Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I wanted to try out the three marker challenge. If you don't know what the three marker challenge is, it is a challenge where you take three randomly selected colors and use it in your art piece. I think it's a fun challenge, so I decided to make it a bonus video for this week. I used the Jazz's Arty Games app to randomly select Copic markers that could be used for today's doodle. The colors chosen are E01, R34, and V25. For today's drawing, I wanted to draw a girl bundled up in her coat and scarf. In New York City, it's finally starting to get cold, so I thought this would be a great idea. The cold for me means to stay home and drink something warm like hot chocolate, coffee, or tea. I actually don't like the cold, I prefer to be wrapped up in a blanket all day. Fall and spring are my favorite seasons, but for this year, fall seems to be non-existent since it feels it has gone from summer to winter instantly in a few days. And I wouldn't be surprised if summer comes back for a few extra days randomly this week. Since I was lucky enough to get a skin tone color for this challenge video, I knew I could draw a girl and it wouldn't look weird. For the sketch, I used a Prismacolor erase pencil and for the inking, I used a 0.2 Copic Multiliner pen. For the coloring, I decided to make the hair V25 Pale Blackberry and her scarf to have stripes. I tried to blend the color as best as I could by using purple as a shade on the face and using the red as a shade for the hair. I laid down my purple shade color on the skin area and used my original skin color marker to blend the two colors together. Red was a little hard to use in my opinion since it's a pretty bright of a color compared to the pale purple. So I used it in the stripe pattern on her scarf and shaded the scarf with the skin color. I also used an Uniball Signal gel pen to draw some highlights in her face, clothes, and hair. I wanted to do this challenge to give myself a reason to use my Copic markers. A lot of my work is mostly digital and I wanted to challenge myself to do more traditional art and to try out as many different tools as I can such as inks and watercolors. I'm pretty bad at keeping up with traditional art and I want to challenge myself for November to do more traditional art pieces. Hopefully I can keep up with my challenge. Do you struggle with keeping up with your goals? What do you do to keep yourself going? I promised myself in the month of October that I would post the speed paint video every week. My boyfriend has been encouraging me to keep at it as I keep encouraging him to keep working on the things he wants to work on. We both create goals together and we update each other on our accomplishments. He was really disappointed in me when I didn't keep up with Inktober this year, but was still happy that I wasn't letting myself feel down about it and kept going with my other tasks. I'm actually really proud of myself that I was able to keep my promise of posting consistently for a month and has led me to be more determined to keep going. If you'd like to see more challenge videos from me, please let me know in the comment section below. Hope you guys enjoyed this little doodle and if you want to see more digital and traditional speed paints, please make sure you subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye.